What up, Serato World? This is OP, Artist Relations Manager for Serato, here at the Brooklyn studio to talk about the Pioneer Nexus 2 series of Mixer and CDJ, connecting them with HID mode and the Club Kit. So first thing you want to do is make sure that you go to the Serato website and purchase the Club Kit expansion pack. You can also purchase the Serato DJ Club Kit from inside Serato DJ within the My Serato window. To update the firmware for the mixer, make sure you have a USB stick handy. Instructions on the Pioneer site will show you how to use a USB stick to update the firmware for the mixer. For the CDJs and the first computer running on USB-A, I'm going to have those running on channels 1 and 2. And for the turntables and the second computer, I'm going to have those running on USB-B, running through channels 3 and 4. In order to assign each of those, I'm going to use the switchers here at the top. Channels 1 and 2 will be switched to A, channels 3 and 4 will be switched to B. When making the connection with the USB cables, you want to make sure that A and B for MIDI are turned on. So let's talk about the CDJs using HID mode and the club kit for the connection to Serato 1.9.5. First, make sure that the firmware is updated on both of the CDJs. Again, you will need to use your USB stick with the firmware update from the Pioneer website in order to make that happen. Once the firmware is updated, then you want to link your CDJs to the computer. On the back of each CDJ, there will be a USB port. You want to run USB cables from each of the CDJs into the USB hub, and then have the USB hub connected to your computer. Then you want to go to the CDJ and press the link button. You also want to do the same thing on the second CDJ, press the link button. Now you want to turn the encoder knob on each CDJ to choose the deck that you want to control Serato with. In this instance, the first deck, I'm going to turn the knob and choose deck one and press down on the encoder. And on this one, I'm going to turn the encoder and press deck two. Now that we have the CDJs connected in HID mode, we have access to a lot of the features inside of Serato right here on the CDJs. First off, the play button. Second notable feature, the cue points. Other notable features on the CDJ using HID mode for control inside of Serato include loops, needle search, sync, and BPM adjustment with the tempo slider. Now for control for the second computer on USB-B for the sound card. I have my turntables connected to the phono inputs on channels three and four and the switch is selected to B. Now, go to Serato 1.9.5, go to the Setup button. Under Setup, go to the Audio tab, and under the Audio tab, you'll see a button that says Custom. Click on Custom, and that will give you the Pioneer 900 Nexus 2 Utility. Under the Utility setting for Pioneer, you want to make sure that USB 5 and 6, which stands for Channel 3, and USB 7 and 8, which stands for Channel 4, all say Control Tone Phono. And there you have it, connection to Serato 1.9.5 using the new Pioneer Nexus 2 series mixer and CDJ. Make sure you log on to serato.com for more info.